Oh, Banjo and Kazooie created by uh, Dandy Chiggins. I played me some Banjo Kazooie for N64. That, oh, that's a good one. Look at this N64, you guys. I want to replay Banjo Kazooie. That was a really good one. In my life. Me neither. <laughs> oh, really? Is it a Canadian it, thing? No. Is it? Uh, I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Canadians made any video games. Uh, Benjo, thank Kazooie. <laughs> Benjo, it's like Mario on steroids. That looks great. It's like looks Mario great. on steroids. Yeah, you got your little Kazooie pet and your Banjo, and you got to do puzzles, and you get all these abilities, and there's like talent trees to make your guy better. It's like Mario on steroids. It's really so. Cool. One has a Banjo and one has a Kazoo. Uh, <laughs> I don't remember that part. You're probably right. Uh huh. Thank you for the follow, Tiago. Tiago came out in 1989. No, 98. Sorry. Sounds about right. All right, go ahead. Fire away. This is awesome already. Loving it. Do you want me to read it? What do you want? Okay. <laughs> this is Banjo and Kazooie themed coaster blueprint. Climp, spir climp, climb, <laughs> spiral oh. mountain, and head into Gruntilda's lair and all around. The land and search for the coveted G. Def default seating view, ride both day and night, please. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, we can do that. Thank you for the follow, so, GM poster. Uh, I forgot. So <laughs> yeah, I think there, I think there was some sort of element of music in there, banjo kazooie. I just don't remember it clearly. Uh, but that you, I remember now that you picked up music notes instead of like stars, like Mario does. I thank you for the follow, mm. Fire Cat. Yeah. Okay. So we'll do. We'll start with the day run. And uh, there's a look at the stats, you guys. And we're probably dealing with another launch. Drive tire, maybe? Giga Rage. Wow. <laughs> you su surprised me there. Look at that. Shocking. Very, very rare. We're going seat view. Starting with day. Uh, I, I turned the volume down so low, I got to fix that. There's no, there's no music, because there's supposed to be... I should put a soundtrack on it, maybe? For the night run. Typing on the coaster. Okay, we need a soundtrack, you guys. We need a soundtrack. Sorry. What's, it's fine. For sure. What's what, what's um what's a good like happy soundtrack? Fairy tale. The uh, dragon dungeon. Joy in us all. No, that's holiday. Let's do that. And we'll do nighttime. No, that sounds terrible. Fantasy Castle. Ma <laughs> Magical Town. Sure. I'm kind of indecisive. All right, let's go. <laughs> Wait, Three. I didn't do nighttime. Of this stuff brings back some memories. Banjo Kazooie <laughs> N64. Um, Great. Really cool. I I just I see all this stuff. I remember the town. Now, if if I remember correctly, you guys you guys could tell me in chat if you remember. I think Gruntilda 
there was an actual mountain of her in the like in the middle of the map. Is that right? Do I remember that right? Um, uh, and then like the little village. I love the little Kazooie villages. You'd run around collecting all the notes and seeing all the little what? critters. Was it a platform or what was it? TB Karate says yes. Yeah, no, it was like a 3D. It's like Mario, Mario 64. Oh, okay. Yeah. But you had, a, I guess, a banjo and a Kazooie and music and <laughs> stuff. I, I don't remember that well, but I, I actually, like, I'm craving to go play it again. Like, it, it was a really, 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 really good game. Yeah, it was better than Mario 64, in my opinion. I think it was so good they made a banjo Kazooie too, didn't they? Well, what, I mean, there's another what is, one what that is came chat, out. What does Chad think? 2008. Was, Nuts and bolts. Was, was, was banjo Kazooie better than Mario 64, guys? Mario or banjo? Oh, let me bring Chad on. So, uh, banjo Tooie. Oh, that's what that was called, banjo Tooie. That's right. Mario. Grantilda Mountain. I'm looking this up now. I see Grantilda here. Okay. Goodbye, Rambrek. Rambrecht. Sorry. Rambrecht. Nuts and bolts was very yeah. bad. Banjo over Mario. There's oh, there are miniatures as well. Wow. <laughs> Banjo Tooie is worse than ET for Atari. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. Nothing beats Mario. Sorry, Johnny. I think maybe uh, I, I overplayed Mario because like I, I I remember renting N64s and then I bought an N64 and then I bought Mario and I was just like, okay, I, I overplayed it. And then when I played Banjo-Kazooie, I was like, there's nothing like this. But the funny <laughs> thing is I, I didn't put as many hours into Banjo-Kazooie as I did Mario. In mm. fact, I don't even think I've finished Banjo-Kazooie and I did finish Mario. On paper, Parrots. Mario's probably better. I just remember <laughs> all the new elements and all the new mechanics of Banjo Kazooie being so refreshing, and um, I think that's why I remember it being more fun. You know what I mean? Mm. <clears throat> this is a what the hell is this? Um, well, well, I wanted to ask you guys, especially the people watching the vods, do mm. you prefer this style? I know, like. I have to hide chat while we're on the coaster, mm -hmm. but when I look over at chat and see everybody's reactions on the coasters, especially the creators being able to read everybody's comments, it's it's quite cool. You don't quite get the same experience from the coaster spotlights pre-recorded. So my question to you guys, both yeah. the guys in chat uh, and, and everyone watching the VODs, do you prefer the live format for coaster spotlight? Is this something we should do more often? Just for like non-contest stuff, like a, a coaster spotlight marathon, because we, we could we could do that, and uh, we yeah. can make a list of all the people who are being featured if they can show up and see people react to their creations. Might be cool. This uh, only works as long as the creator can attend, which is often not possible. Well, I mean, they get I mean... to see the live reactions in the chat on the vod, right? It still becomes a yeah. vod. Yeah, true. From what I've seen, the ability to see these comments is incredible. I've liked the li uh, live format for smaller stuff. Yeah, maybe for like big exploration contests and, and you know, movie contests, unlimited piece count stuff. Mm. I like the extra commentary. Uh, I like the live, but sound alerts need to be off. Yeah, they've screwed <laughs> things up a few times. <laughs> 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 yeah. Okay, well, people seem to be liking it. Some people are mixed, but I mean, looks... you can't, you know, like you can't please everyone. So it's always going to be. That's true. Know. It's true. Yeah. Okay. Shall we go on to the next one? Well, we could just do, yeah. we could do a bit of both. How's that guys? Yeah. All right. Moving on. Okay. Great next. job. Daddy chickens on Banjo Kazooie. 